On August 26, 2024, history might be made in Major League Baseball. Danny Jansen could become the first player ever to play for two teams in the same game. How is this even possible? Let's dive in. Danny Jansen, a talented catcher, had spent his entire career with the Toronto Blue Jays, debuting with them back in 2018. But in a twist that no one saw coming, he was traded to the Boston Red Sox during the 2024 trade deadline. Now here is where things get interesting. Back on June 26, 2024, a game between the Blue Jays and Red Sox was suspended due to rain in the top of the second inning. And it just so happened that Jansen was at bat facing an 0-1 count when the game was paused. Now, months later, the game is set to resume on August 26, but this time with Jansen now playing for the Red Sox. This could be the first time ever a player has played for two teams in the same game. Can you imagine? The first pitch after the game resumes could mark an unprecedented moment in Major League Baseball history. But what will happen when Jansen steps up to bat for the Red Sox? Could this really happen? To understand just how rare this moment could be, let's look back at some historic trades. On August 4th, 1982, Joel Youngblood got a hit playing for the New York Mets against the Chicago Cubs in Wrigley Field. The historic ballpark didn't have lights and only hosted day games. Before his next at bat, Youngblood was pulled from the lineup because he'd been traded to the Montreal Expos. So Youngblood got on a plane, flew to Philadelphia where the Expos were playing the Phillies at Veterans Stadium for a night game and was put in the lineup in the sixth inning to pinch hit and reached base with a single. Thus, he was the first to get two hits with two teams in two different cities on the same day. But it doesn't stop there. In 1922, Cliff Heathcote and Max Flack were traded between the Cardinals and the Cubs during a doubleheader. They switched uniforms between games, each playing for their new team in the second game. But even those scenarios pale in comparison to what's about to happen with Jansen. Major League Baseball rules are clear. Once a player is traded, they're removed from their current game and sent to their new team. But because of the suspended game and the trade deadline, this rule is about to be tested like never before. When the game resumes on August 26th, if Jansen is in the lineup for Boston, he would take over the ninth spot from catcher Reese McGuire. The first pitch will not just resume a game, but it could make Danny Jansen a part of baseball lore. A moment that would redefine how we think about trades, games, and Major League Baseball history. Danny Jansen's potential moment with history is a testament to the unpredictable and thrilling nature of baseball. One player, two teams, one game. History in the making. What a happy accident indeed.